Hello YouTube. It's been a while since I've done anything with my Legos, so I thought it was a good time to return to that. Here's the um, Lego Power Functions servo motor, uh, item number 88004 if you want to buy that. It's a very nice uh, servo uh, setup, which has 15 um, fixed positions from uh, 90 degrees here to 90 degrees here. And uh, I have a, an Arduino controlling that using this um, potentiometer as an input. You'll see that here's on the scope. Here's the PWM signal sent from the Arduino. And as I increase that, the servo steps along the path to one side. Now you first uh, have to understand this is not a regular servo signal. This is not the um, uh, 0.5 to 2.5 millisecond over 20 millisecond cycle, but a completely different scheme of control. That's um, 0 to 100% PWM just for the these 90 degrees here. If you want to, to go to the other side, um, you have to switch the, the control channel. You know, the, the motor has four wires. It has the ground, C1, C2, and uh, 9 volts. Uh, currently, it, it controls the Arduino controls through a transistor that uh, translates the 5 volts of the Arduino to 9 volts of the power supply and the servo controls uh, line C1. If I disconnect C1 and instead connect C2, then the motor responds in the other direction. This means that if you want to to use your Arduino to control uh, this uh, servo motor, you'll have to use uh, either uh, two separate um, PWM channels and do a, a smart code to control that, or employ some uh, some other trick because two channels are, are to play here. I won't go into the details of uh, translating the 5 volts to 9 volts, that's uh, pretty basic, but uh, ju that's uh, just to show you that these uh, servo motors can quite easily be controlled using an Arduino and it could be a very interesting project to make some uh, robot um, Lego cars or uh, or Lego, just any other Lego robots um, that are controlled using the Arduino or other microcontrollers. It's uh, entirely possible and I think it's uh, very fun also. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.